What is going on everybody? It is Frank the Tank coming at you with quite a special video here. So, whoever runs the PBA's YouTube channel, they decided to upload the Mark Roth Plastic Ball Championship of, I believe that's, yeah, 2009-2010. And I for one think that this is an awesome idea. It provides like a challenge for the pros and it's just it's just interesting to see, you know, them using nothing but plastic balls. I mean, take a look at this. Nice and straight down the lane. It's it's beautiful. So, I don't know what came over them to, you know, decide to stop doing this event because this this event was uh, in my opinion a great great idea uh you know it really answers the question what would it be like if the pba professionals of today would were using nothing but plastic balls to throw down the lane because somebody told me and i i don't know if i think this is true but somebody told me that way back in the days um the bowlers of way back didn't have anything else to use but plastic bowling balls or spare balls which kind of makes sense if it is if it's true which i think it is it makes sense because uh you know th obviously they didn't have the stuff that we have today to be able to create those kick-ass bowling balls that we have today so uh yeah that's definitely interesting and it answers that question what would it be like if pros use nothing but spare balls to throw down the lane so that inspired an idea what would it be like if i frank the tank used nothing but a plastic ball well ladies and gentlemen say hello to the team storm clear electric blue spare ball so this thing actually looks really awesome more awesome than what it looked like in the picture it's actually the it looks like really bright blue in the picture but it's actually slightly just slightly a bit darker than what it seems so um <coughs> if there's if there's one thing that you do not see about this ball on the internet is like a proper video or even other photos of what this thing is so now we finally have one and yeah here it is so this this thing is actually really cool it's like it's it's just like the Belmo spare ball like the words aren't actually like on the thing you know like they're like that you know what I'm saying like way back in there so if the, I don't even know how to explain that but yeah it's like take a look here see what I mean it's like it's almost like the Belmo spare ball if you ask me in terms of like how they have the the words way in there and it's all like clear which makes sense because it's obviously on the name of the ball team storm clear electric blue or something like that but yeah this thing is really really awesome of course team storm right there so yeah that is what this thing looks like we finally have a proper look at it so the challenge here is that I'm going to go and play three games with nothing but this. And one of the reasons I got this is because for those of you who have kept up with my videos will know that I use the Team Storm White Belmonte Spare Ball. And the thing is, is that let's let's face this fact, OK? Bowling balls crack. They get they get, you know, scratched. They get chipped. And the thought of seeing that white Belmonte spare ball get chipped or cracked that would just tear my heart to pieces and I'm I'm just afraid of that happening so I think what's going to happen is I'm going to put the white Belmonte aside I mean I will still use it every now and then but I think I'm going to toss that one aside for now and start using this one because this thing I really don't care if it gets you know chipped or cracked or whatever because it's not rare it's not expensive in fact I actually only got this for about 60 bucks on eBay. Can you believe that? This thing goes for between 90 to 100. But thank God for the whole bidding system on eBay, I managed to steal this for 60 bucks. So, yay. So, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to get this drilled and then we're going to go play a three game series with nothing but a spare ball. Let's do this.
that is your Hammer Tough Spare Replay. Remember this one a little later in the match. I'm not dreaming, just hear me out. What I'm feeling, I gotta get it out. It's half empty, the glass in front of me. I'm not sure about these, how I wanna be. Wow, you are really, really bad. I'm not sure about this, really have I seen the world now. I got slow down, before I have another breakdown. It won't be long to this down now. I'm better off on my own, cause all I want is right in front of me. It's right in front. Okay, everybody, that is the Clear Storm Electric Blue Spare Ball. I think that's what it's called. I'm not sure. But yeah, that there it is. Um, there's not very much I can say about the ball because it's a spare ball. It goes straight down the lane. All I can really say about it is uh, it looks good when I'm throwing it down the lane. Um, and also, it looks a lot better than I thought it did in the pictures because um, I'm pretty sure a lot of you uh, um, know this already, but... Um, 
For those of you who don't, the pictures on the Storm website of the bowling balls don't look 100% exactly like uh, like they do in like in actuality. Like for example, here's a picture of the bowling ball on Storm's website, and if you'll notice, uh, it looks a lot br the the blue color. It looks like a lot brighter, and then if you look here, it actually looks a lot more toned down on this one, and. Yeah, I mean, it it was it turned out to look a lot better than I thought it did, and that uh, that I'm actually uh, kind of glad because you know that really bright blue color, like for example on the Storm Ice Spare Ball, I really don't like it. It's just not my thing. But yeah, I'm glad that um, the the blue color is actually a little bit more toned down on this uh, compared to what the photo shows. But yeah, there you go. Um, it took quite the beating, I'll say that. I mean, it's got a couple of scratches and stuff on it, no big deal. And also, my fingers suffered quite a bit too, as you can see there, I lost some skin. But that's uh, kind of the price you pay when you're a two-hander and you need to get your fingers really way down in the holes. And yeah, um, if you're wondering, yes, this is how far down you have to go if you're bowling with two hands. I mean, some people I know only go up to the that first line right there, but I learned from Jason Belmonte that... Um, he puts his fingers all the way down to here, so that's what I tried, and I found that uh, I got a lot better grip on the bowling ball, and uh, it helped with, you know, getting my revs in there because my fingers are farther down, but yeah, that right there is the price that you pay if you go this far down, but yeah, there you go. That is your uh, spare ball right there, and of course, um, here are the uh, two golden treasures. The white and black Belmo Spare Ball that you guys love to see. Uh, this one, I, uh, as you guys saw in my community post, if you haven't seen it yet. Uh, yeah, I had it, uh, I took it to the pro shop and I had it completely cleaned and shined up to look like as if it just came out of the box. Because uh, I made that decision that I'm not going to use it anymore. I decided that I'm going to put it on display because uh, when I... Um, when my pro shop guy showed me his spare ball and he told me that bowling balls do crack eventually and stuff like that, that, you know, it's, it's just a part of, a part of the bowling balls life cycle. Uh, there's nothing you can do about it. Bowling balls crack eventually. They do chip, they do get scratched. And I don't know if I can just bear to see that happen to this beauty right here. So that's why I made the decision to go for that because I don't mind that thing getting ruined because it's not worth a whole lot. So yeah, this thing. I do care that it gets ruined, so that's why I'm not going to bother to use it anymore. It's going to go on the shelf, on display, right next to this. And this just looks so cool. I mean, it, it's like it's like what my friend said. He told me it looks like yin and yang or something like that, and it kind of does. It's pretty awesome. But anyway, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, of course, I've got more to come. Uh, but uh, for now, I'm just blessing y'all with this one. The Team Storm Clear Electric Blue Spare Ball. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed. I'm Frank the Tank. I'll see you guys in another one. See you later.